Well, we this is a course that there was an old course on this site, not this exact site. We redid the rooting and blew it up and started over again. Tees are elevated. The greens are woven in the uh, ponds, which are basically lagoons, which have all kinds of fish and wildlife, an occasional caiman, lots of iguanas running around, and it's very much a nature botanical garden. Lots of trees were brought in, but until you get the last few holes, which are right along the beach, so when you turn home, the wind's at your back, and you sail on home for your rum punch. It's, and it's a gorgeous property all around. It's a, it's a, it is. It's a natural for golf. It, was, um, it drains well. It has lagoons. El Yunque, the famous mountain, is over within sight. And um, basically, it's 18 holes by, by yourself, and you're out in nature's wonderland, beautifully maintained. And it's, a, it's an efficient game. You can play quickly. That's just how you drew it up. Well, <laughs> architects should follow his own line. We're re recrafting the east course for the new ownership. The old Dorado Beach, which was 36 holes, and Siramar, another 36 holes, was under the management of Hyatt. To be honest, they kind of let it go and then sold it to this new ownership. And so we're kind of doing an archaeology dig, trying to find out the old greens my dad built and restore them. We're extending the course 400 yards for the modern day, but we're following his principles of long runway tees. In fact, you could probably land a Cessna on it. Major work. Okay. Yeah. Then that'll we're, entail we're, what? We're redoing the, um, have redone most of the bunkers, new white sand, draining properly, and we're going to open, and we're going to open up all the greens. Uh, it's like uh, open heart surgery. We're going to give it a new pump. <laughs> but basically, we're recrafting the greens. And there's a discussion whether it should be uh, past palum, which is now the sort of the grass of fashion, or uh, tiff dwarf, uh, super, you know, ultra dwarf, which I personally prefer because I want to be different from the Mackay course, which is past palum. And it rains a lot there. It's a technical issue, but you have to have salt for past palum to really work, and you don't have salt there. But we want this to be at, at, at absolute championship level, and it will be it will be reopened by November. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay.